What's good y'all, it's the Calisthenic Christian. I'm gonna be covering how to properly perform the incline dumbbell bench press. First, let's look at the angle of the bench. The higher you go, the more shoulder, the lower you go, the more chest. For this exercise, we want at about a 30 to 45 degree angle. There's four points of contact. Your feet are firmly on the ground, your hips, your upper back, and your head are against the bench. We wanna focus on retracting our shoulders and bringing them back, pointing our chest upward. To safely pick up the dumbbell, you can do it two ways. Put one hand on your knee for support, or if the dumbbells get too heavy, I recommend you do this gorilla stance pickup. Now that the dumbbells are at the edge of your knee, you want to avoid kicking back as you come back because you can actually really damage your shoulder there and tear something. Instead, kick up first and then lie back down. Now let's look at the angle of our elbows. Avoid externally rotating them and also avoid really internally rotating them. It's more ideal to keep them at a 45 degree bend. Now the depth that you go in pressing the dumbbells is going to be different for everyone. For me personally, I can get pretty low because my mobility is great. You may only be able to go 90 degrees, that's fine. Work on this over time. Focus on bringing the dumbbells in the path of your lower chest and as you come down and lower, you're inhaling and as you're coming up, you're exhaling. 